Hello my earth people, um, for all my earth element signs, I know it's a little bit different this month, uh, I'll be doing it, uh, just to change things up, so I hope you like the reading. Um, for you earth people, I do sense some things that are, it's kind of a marriage in a sense, things are coming together and joining and, and becoming something different. Um, contracts will be formed that you'll have to sign. Uh, people will start committing to each other, start committing, uh, whether you're committing to someone or someone's committing to you. It, it, I feel there's there's a marriage, but it's a very, um, it's not in a sense of love, it's in a sense of, of a business relationship in a sense that this has to be done to get that, you know, that done. Um, so I do, I do feel that in this month your intuition, um, it's not going to mislead you. you. You should really, really trust that. Um, it's going to point out some things to you that you might not have noticed before. And because it's a business contract, you might feel the need that you have to do it. Um, those intuition uh, pings are those little little pits in your stomach, that little, little buzz in the back of your neck. Uh, you know, whatever... Uh, it comes through to you. It's letting you know that you should take a back, take a moment, and sit back, and realize just what you are signing into, what you are committing to. If you cannot commit to this 100%, and if they cannot commit to you 100%, then you should not do it, or you should amend uh, the rules, amend the uh, the agreement between each other. Um, it's saying that you have to be a, a, an extreme realist right now. Um, I don't know if this is something that has been reoccurring for you, but I feel like there's a theme going on this year for, for most of you Earth people that people you have committed to something or people have committed to you and then it kind of fades away and the agreement kind of gets lost in the mix and you forget to uphold the agreement or uphold have someone uphold to that agreement, you know, however you want to say that. Um, I feel this month is particular for you to saying that this agreement, this, this certain big thing that's going on for you, this is a big commitment for you, that you should pay attention to it and honor it and make sure the other person to honor it because it's going to set a, a wonderful foundation for you later on to build on. Um, like I said, for the fire people, you know, truth is a wonderful thing to, to have a great foundation. You know, you can build a lot on truth. But with dishonesty, if you build on dishonesty, as soon as you find out that they're dishonest, everything crumbles and then your whole world is turned upside down in a moment. So be honest with yourself this month. Be honest. Can you really honor this commitment? Can you really honor this, this agreement? Can they do it? Can, are they going to uphold their end of the bargain? And if you think they can't, even there, if there's a little sliver of doubt in you, um, like jury duty, if there's a sliver of doubt, then vote not guilty. You know, then move on. Realize that that there, it's it, there's there's something there that you might not have the time or energy to really figure out, but it's not good for you. Um, if you you feel that that you need to be with this person, you need to to have this in your life. Make sure you bring those up in the conversation and your um, in your negotiations, in a sense. When you're negotiating, make sure that you bring everything out to the light. That that makes you feel uncomfortable because you can't build anything on dishonesty. There has to be a communication. Uh, so the really the big thing this month for you guys is communication and intuition. Um, and that's all I can really say as far as what I'm getting for you guys. Um, I did pull some cards for you, and they said the same thing. Um, there is a sad embrace card, and that is saying that there are going to be some some emotions that are coming through to you. Um, there might be so, some things happening around you that, you know, bad things are happening to them, and you might need to console the other person. I kind of feel what that, that card is saying, that there will be uh, a period this month where you have to console someone, and it's okay to be uncomfortable with that, but just make sure the other person is getting comfort uh, comforted because um, 
I feel like th there's there's something going around with the Earth people this month that they're they're going to need to have that nurture and energy as well uh, for a lot of people that are around them. Um, I don't know if it, it's something happening in this month for the other elements or not. Um, so with the other cards, I kind of broke it down already. To um, I already already told you what I. I thought was coming through you guys and these cards said the same thing but I'm going to tell you um, what the two cards the goblin and the moonlight came up and these are cards that the goblins goblins are born are, are, are born from something that wasn't quite pure that wasn't quite a uh, hundred percent of what it should be so you have this this thing that that's there and sometimes goblins don't know they're goblins and you kind of have to hey you, you're a goblin and and this is what you need to correct. It's 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 like that the contract thing we're saying. If if you build something on dishonesty, it, it's not going to build a wonderful thing overall. Uh, it'll it'll start turning. It'll become a domino effect. Other things will come. Bad things will come from it in your life. And so you need to to bring that to to the attention of the other party uh, in the beginning and to yourself. Um, and the Moonlight card is just saying, trust your intuition. Your intuition is coming through to you uh, strongly this month. Um, it's, it's just, it's screaming at you, and you need to realize that it's, that's what it is. It's telling you to be cautious. It's not telling you to let fear direct you. Don't let fear um, dictate what you do in your life. Don't let it wall you up and fence you in. It's just warning you that there needs to be a caution and there needs to be a moment to where you kind of address the pink elephant in the room. Uh, address that thing that no one wants to talk about. Because that one thing that you're not going to talk about, it's going to affect everyone later. Uh, and the other card was commitment and that, that's, you know, an agreement between two parties are, are you and a, a thing that you're doing and you have to be honest with yourself. If there is not a uh, complete honesty there's there's no truth involved and it's not a relationship and it's just a lie it's just a farce it's just an illusion that you have created and so you need to you need to make the illusion real you need to to commit to whatever cause you are are committed to this month um, so that's everything I have for you earth people this month uh, I feel odd saying earth people it's like I'm speaking to someone like I'm from another planet um, so you earth elements that's all I have for you uh, I hope you guys have a wonderful month and I don't know maybe next month I'll do the video again for you guys uh, if not this is Bray Hawk signing out and you guys have a great month